Despite big games adding a ton of new items, gift bags, even eggs to the game, some of the most basic items are still where the profit's at. And on top of that, big games does tend to just go back and randomly change old things sometimes, so it is worth testing out. So in this video, we are doing exactly that and we're opening over a billion diamonds worth of large gift bags to see how much profit we can get. I have a feeling these large gift bags are going to be very profitable, but I'll tell you about that in a minute because at the end of this video, we'll have an exact number about how valuable these gift bags are and how much you guys should be buying them for. And since I am helping you guys to get a profit, all I ask is that you give the video a like and subscribe for more helpful pet simulator content. And if you want to get even more wealthy, make sure you join my discord link down in the description below. We do daily huge giveaways on there as well as have a helpful community of valuable investors. But let's just get right into this opening. All right, you guys. So we are back in Pet Simulator 99 and today we are doing a massive opening. And this isn't an opening that we haven't done before on this channel. I think we probably have done like three or four large gift bag openings on this channel in the past. And honestly, this is kind of how I got started making videos videos on this game. Even my first video opening these large gift bags, the fruit mastery didn't even exist. Anyways though, despite there being like probably a million different ways you could potentially make money on this game, it's always good to go back to the classics and see how much we can make just opening a basic item that pretty much everybody in the game has. Another major benefit of these large gift bags is that they are so common in the trading plaza that you could pretty much get as many as you want as long as you're patient enough to server hop. Like to be completely honest with you it didn't even take me that long to get a hundred thousand of these so honestly in terms of investments this is kind of probably one of the easiest ones that we've done in a while now the reason why these gift bags are so much more profitable than even they were back in the day when i was opening them is because of how important the fruit mastery is and the thing about fruit mastery is that it takes just way too long to upgrade it i believe it takes a little over 3.5 million upgraded fruit in order to max out your mastery so because of that people need a lot of fruits in this game because maxing out fruit mastery is essentially going to give you like a permanent boost and it actually increases how much you can grind by a lot so pretty much everybody in this game wants max fruit mastery on all of their accounts which in the end is going to cost you around 1 billion diamonds worth of fruit in order to max out for this reason is why large gift bags are so good nowadays because they actually give you multiple ways of getting fruits so just off the bat opening a large gift bag will give you all the different assortment of fruits as well as that it'll give you the fruit gift bags that also give you little bundles of fruit and even more than that it also gives you the small gift bags which also give you fruit so at the end of the day large gift bags are worth so much because they are just the best way in order to get fruit so anybody that's trying to level up their gift mastery is going to be opening these because in general it's just hard to get that much fruit but anyways this is going to take me a while to open so i'm probably just going to get right into this opening as you guys can see i cleared out my diamonds completely so i have zero right here and i also have zero items in chance potions so we'll know exactly what the value of these large gift bags will be if you guys open them on average i'm also debating opening the small gift bags that we get just to see how much fruit we can get in total because the value that we get from these gift bags i'm actually going to calculate using like the real value of the fruits so not the rat value but the value that you can get if you sell them in bulk but honestly i think even if we just use the rat value we will still make profit on opening these and the glorious thing about doing these large gift bags in this update is that you can now hotkey it so i can actually open it with my screen and we can actually see all of the items popping up now, I'm not sure if that would look cool at all or anything, so we're just going to try it out for this video. We will probably do some sort of speed run, and then I'll stop like halfway through, and then we can go over some of the stuff that we've gotten so far. Either way, though, I'll figure it out. I'll see you guys in a second when we're like halfway done with these large gift bags.
All right, you guys, we are finally done with 100,000 gift bags. I didn't end up doing a little checkup in the middle just because I didn't want to string out this video too long. I think you guys get the idea. Everybody pretty much knows what you can get from this. Now, one thing I did do extra was I did open up all of the fruit bundles just so we can know exactly how much fruit we get. I didn't want to make this video too complicated. I just want you guys to know exactly what you guys can get from these gift bags so you know whether you should open them or just sell them. But anyways, of course, we got all the usual stuff, pretty much all of the common items that we usually get. And on top of that, we got almost 85,000 thousand of each fruit which is pretty crazy that means on average from each large gift bag you get about 0.85 of each fruit so that's honestly not too bad at all it still is nowhere near the amount of fruit that you actually need to get max fruit mastery but if you're just trying to make a profit this is a very good way to do so now besides that we also got 3,000 charm stones 7,000 regular gift bags a whole bunch of these bundles now these bundles are extremely good for getting your gift mastery up as you can see i'm already 99 so that doesn't really matter for me but we also got 2500 of each of these like crystal key parts which is good just remember if you are combining this combine it one at a time because you have a much higher chance to get these tech keys we also got 1500 of the regular spinny wheel tickets and 1500 name tags and then in terms of potions, we're just going to get like all the basic potions, 55,000 of these tier two potions, nothing crazy. And then in chance, of course, we just have all the regular stuff as well. Now I'm actually going to go ahead and box everything up except for the fruits, because we're going to do a special little calculation for these. So I'll see you guys in a second with that. All right, you guys, so we boxed up everything. And now one thing I should point out as well is that we did get 917 million diamonds from 100,000 gift bags, which essentially means that on average, each gift bag is going to give you right back 9.17k diamonds. That is also not that bad considering that these gift bags were 11k in wrap when I opened it. So you're essentially only paying 2,000 diamonds for all of the items that you're getting in each of the gift bags. So not a bad price at all. Now if we take a look at the box, I haven't seen it quite yet. But this is the box right here, and it has 241 million diamonds worth of stuff. So adding that 241 million number to the 917 million diamonds that we have raw, that's going to give us 1.158 billion, which means that on average, when you're opening these gift bags, just from the diamonds, plus all of the items, not including the fruit, you're getting back 11.58 thousand diamonds each. And considering the wrap value of these large gift bags were just 11K when I bought them, that means you're making a profit right there. Now, actually where the big money comes in is the fruits that you got so as you guys can see here we have 85,000 of each now if we look at the wrap values for each you're going to see some varying numbers somewhere around 200 diamonds but the beautiful thing about selling fruits is that when you're selling them in bulk people are most definitely willing to overpay because getting enough fruits for your mastery takes absolutely forever so people are actually willing to spend more like 300 diamonds per fruit so after doing the calculations this is roughly 422,000 fruit in total now if we sell that at a price of 300 each that's going to give us an additional 126.7 million in value so basically if we take that 1.15 billion number that we got from just the other items and our raw diamonds combined and add on to it the value of these fruits that we got if we sold it in bulk at 300 a piece that means in total we would have 1.28 billion in value which means that under our final calculation, the total value that you get if you are selling all of your fruits for 300 each, when you open these large gift bags, you're going to be getting an average value of 12,800 diamonds. So if you can get large gift bags for under 11,500 each, that means you are getting these fruits for absolutely free. And then you can use those to level up your fruit mastery if you want, or you can resell them in bulk to people for around 300 a piece. And the wrap value of these large gift bags does change quite a bit but i think on average you can usually find them for around 11,500, and at that 11.5 thousand price range you are going to be making a decent amount so that's my suggestion for you guys to be perfectly honest i thought these would be worth much more but it definitely is good to note that on average you're going to get around 9,170 gems per bag that just gives you a rough estimate of what you can expect being able to get those raw diamonds right back is really good because then you can just go ahead and buy even more large gift bags and just keep building up your arsenal of fruits and probably the more fruits you have the more you can get people to actually pay because believe me when i tell you finding someone that has enough fruits for you to get your fruit mastery all the way up is extremely annoying
annoying. But anyways, I hope you guys were able to profit from this and you did end up learning something from this video in general. And if you did, remember to give it a like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys in the next video and peace out.